pretty good and production ready rack system comes with some system like this called a data pipeline. The purpose of a good and bulletproof data pipeline is to ensure that everything that is in our knowledge base is either up to date or correct. The reason this is important is because most rack systems are actually dealing with the customer. And the last thing you want to do is have your rack system outputting wrong information. I mean, we know company prices, policies change all the time. So this system that took me a little while to build, but works perfectly, runs on Google Drive and it's constantly watching for either new files or updated files. And whenever a file is updated or we add a new file to our folder called knowledge base, we then download that file, depending on what kind of file it is, whether it's a Google Doc, PDF, text file, or HTML, we then generate something called a hash, which is basically like a unique digital fingerprint, kind of like its own ID. And then we check our knowledge base and compare the hash to, hey, does this hash already exist in our knowledge base? Then we have three conditions. If the file doesn't exist already, there's going to be no hash. Then we have, okay, if there is a hash already, is it equal to it or is it not equal to it? If the hash is equal to the one that we just submitted, then we just want to go back and loop over and check for the next file because we don't want to do anything. If the hashes are not equal, we then want to clear out our knowledge base of the old hash or the old knowledge base. And then after we clear out the knowledge base of all the old information, it updates itself with all the new information. Now, let's say the owner of the business just wants to completely redo the knowledge base and they want to delete the file in total. Then I have another system that watches another folder for a file to hit it called our trash bin. Once it hits the trash bin, we just make sure, hey, does this already exist in our knowledge base? If the file ID does exist in the knowledge base, the one that they deleted, we then delete every single chunk of data that has to do with that file that they wanted gone. And obviously, I want to make this a quick vid because people's attention span on TikTok is very short, but there's so many more techniques that go into having a good data pipeline, like giving chunk descriptions, having good metadata, something called CAG or cache augmented generation, which is basically you labeling each chunk and giving it like a little summary before the agent has to actually look through it. I know I keep saying it. I'm going to say it again. You need to be learning RAG. There is no better system where you can promise to a business and deliver on your promises. I just launched my free school community where I teach this stuff called the RAG Lab.